What is the difference between dots for staccatos and dots for dotted notes? I'll start by defining these two things and then I'll compare and contrast them. What is a dot for staccatos or articulation dot? Quite simply, a dot that is vertically placed compared to the note, so above or below the note head and centered, is an articulation dot. It tells you what kind of touch to use with the note. Staccato dots tell us to bounce right off the note and keep it short when playing it. If you see staccatos on longer notes that might ordinarily get held, performance practice frequently tells us to hold the note for only half its value, but that may depend on your instrument, the piece, the speed, and so on. And the physical motions you use to play that note will also depend on your instrument. Pianists alone can choose from several ways to execute a staccato. Here are some examples of staccato indications on notes. What is an augmentation dot? What is an augmentation dot and why do we need it? Well, of course, not all music falls neatly into note values like half, quarter, eighth, and sixteenth. Sometimes we need note lengths that fall in between these lengths, or sometimes we need notes that are longer than anything we've talked about so far. That's where dots and ties come in handy, and we'll focus on dots here. Note that the dot is placed just to the right of the given note, and maybe a little bit higher to avoid the staff line but it's oriented horizontally compared to the note head. Here's what we call an augmentation dot on a half note. An augmentation dot adds one half of whatever value the note would have normally. So if the half note gets two beats, a dotted half note would get two plus half of two. That's of course one. So two plus one is three and the dotted half note gets three beats. Here is a dotted quarter note. The quarter note gets one beat most of the time, so the dotted quarter will get one plus one half. That's one and a half beats, or you could think of it as three eighth notes. You can add dots to any note value you want to get 1.5 times the normal value of that note. Here is a chart of how the dots change the values of frequently used notes. And here's how this augmentation dot notation looks in context. This is from Beethoven's famous Ode to Joy. In summary, articulation or staccato dots are placed vertically above or below a note. Augmentation dots, however, are placed horizontally compared to the note head, just to the right. Do you have any related questions or other music theory topics you'd like to ask about? If so, leave a comment and let us know. Thank you for watching 